All right, guys, Dr. Jeremy here. Um, a little bit of a soapbox video. Uh, so we're gonna be talking about arthritis and arthrosis. Because again, the arthritis gets thrown around a lot um, and it, it, oftentimes it's very wrong, all right? We think about arthritis, all right? Itis is inflammatory, right? So essentially it's an inflammation of a joint. Um, and really a lot of the times these are autoimmune diseases. All right, so your body's immune system actually identifies your joint structures as a foreign invader and starts to attack it and wear it down, All right? This is rheumatoid arthritis, this is psoriatic arthritis, this is ankylosing spondylitis. There's a couple other ones out there, but those are the big three autoimmune <coughs> um, arth arthritis, right? These are diagnosed, right, via blood tests and also on x-ray. They have very specific um, look on x-ray. There's very specific factors that are seen in their blood. All right, these are typically treated with medications, right, that are going to infect the immune response at the joint level, right? So it's going to downregulate your immune system so it's not constantly attacking your joint, right? There's conservative uh, treatments just to kind of help palliate the pain, right, so people don't feel as much pain, but really it comes down to taking medication and dealing with the pain, and there's not really much else to do. It's, it's your body's chemistry that's attacking yourself, all right? versus arthrosis, right, which is what most people think of when they think of arthritis, right? It's your grandma's achy fingers and elbows and knees, right? It's, it's the guys in their 30s and 40s and 50s that have now been moving around a lot and they're having joint pain, right? You, you get it looked at on x-ray and the doctor says, oh my God, there's all these changes, right? That's not an arthritis, right? That's an arthrosis, right? Because now the joint is chronically degenerated. This is a degenerative problem that's happened because of mechanical issues for a long period of time. And so really when I look at an MRI or I look at an x-ray, really I'm just seeing a log of all the activity that you put through that joint. And the more bony processes we see poking out, the more degeneration we see, it just tells me the more motion and the more volume you've put through that joint and now we're starting to see the body compensate because of all the forces you've put through it. All right. These people will go through bouts of inflammation, right? It's not necessarily achy or stiff all of the time, right? They start moving around more, it starts to hurt more because they have bad mechanics to the point where it's degenerated and they are continuing to have mechanics, bad mechanics that is continuing to cause some acute bouts of inflammation, right? These are the people that are, yeah, just, I just take Advil, I'll take some Aleve, right? Just deal with the pain, right? And they have to keep doing that because they're not attacking the underlying cause, right? This requires a very mechanical treatment, right? And that's really what the pyramid is all about that we have, right? It's where along the pyramid are you deficient that's causing you to have some sort of mechanical pain, right? And if you're allowed to have some sort of mechanical pain for a really long time, we start to see it on an x-ray, all right? So the treatment needs to fit the diagnosis, right? If you have an arthritis, right, you need to get it diagnosed by a blood test, diagnosed on x-ray, and get that thing treated with medical means. I'm not gonna have a profound impact on it with my hand, right? There are certain therapies that can help palliate it, I don't do any of them, right? Arthrosis on the other hand, which most people think is arthritis, right? And it's pain with movement, right? It's mechanical pain that needs to be treated with mechanical methods, right? So that's where the pyramid comes in. Are you missing flexibility? Are you missing mobility? Is your strength balance off? Are you just doing too much? right or are or are your or is your skill off or your mechanics off right and attacking whatever part of that pyramid you are deficient in will start to help you deal with your arthrosis a lot more because you're now going to balance the amount of forces in and around that joint and the joints above and below it so you're not going to be over pressuring it and causing more tissue damage and inflammation all right so this is arthritis versus arthrosis